articles. Articles are a special kind of adjective that introduce nouns. There are only three articles in the entire English language. A, an, and the. But even with only three articles, we still have two categories in which they are divided. Definite article. The definite article introduces a specific noun or nouns. The definite article is the word the. Here's an example of a sentence using the definite article. When the tortoise and the hare raced again, the hare won easily. The speaker uses an article before every noun in this sentence, and she uses the article the because she is referring to a very specific tortoise and hare. The only definite article in the entire English language is the. Indefinite article. Indefinite articles introduce a general noun or nouns. The indefinite articles are a and an. Here's an example of a sentence using an indefinite article. Hey, the Trojans got us a gift. The speaker uses the indefinite article a because he is referring to a general gift. The indefinite articles are a and an. So when do we use a and when do we use an? Well, we use an before any word that begins with a vowel sound. Here's an example of a sentence using the indefinite article an. Kang is an honorable warrior who fears nothing. Since the word that comes after the indefinite article is honorable, we use the indefinite article an. That is because honorable begins with a vowel sound. Notice that it starts with the letter H. H is a consonant, but in the word honorable, the H is not pronounced. The H is silent. Therefore, honorable begins with the vowel sound O, honorable. So using the indefinite article an here is correct. Use the indefinite article a before all other words, or words that begin with consonant sounds. Here's an example of a sentence using the indefinite article a. Kong turned into a hideous zombie. Here, the indefinite article a comes before the word hideous. The word hideous also begins with an h, but in this case, the h is pronounced. Since the h is not silent, the word is beginning with a consonant sound, and therefore, we must use the indefinite article a rather than an. Here are some more examples of sentences using articles. Bro, Bradley just pulled off the coolest trick that I have ever seen. Which article would best complete this sentence? We should use the definite article the because we're referring to a specific trick. In this case, the coolest trick ever. Here's another example of a sentence using articles. Don was digging a hole in the front yard for some reason. Which indefinite article would best complete this sentence? We would use the indefinite article a because it comes before the word hole. The word hole begins with an h, but the h is pronounced. It is not silent. Therefore, it begins with a consonant sound, and we must use the indefinite article a rather than an. And here's one more example of a sentence using an article. Keisha wanted to get an SAT score that would open doors for her. Which indefinite article would best complete this sentence? Here we would use the indefinite article an, because the word SAT begins with a vowel sound. It's true that the word SAT begins with a consonant, but when the letter S is pronounced, it begins with a vowel sound, S, S. So we would use the indefinite article an to complete this sentence. In review, articles are special adjectives that introduce nouns. There are only three articles in the entire English language, a, an, and the. Indefinite articles are used to introduce general nouns, that'd be the words a and an, and the definite article is used to introduce a specific noun. 